Hello friends, in this session we will discuss about how to sort a stack of elements using another temporary stack. So here is an example of stack of elements. The elements inside this stack is not sorted. We need to develop a logic by using temporary stack and produce the output as shown here. The elements in this stack is in ascending order. Now the approach we are going to follow is written here. First declare a temporary stack and then create a while loop. Iterate through while loop until input stack is empty. So inside this while loop the first step is pop out an element from input stack and declare a temporary variable and assign to the popped element. Now as a second step Use a while loop and iterate through the while loop until temporary stack is not empty. Inside this inner while loop, check that the top of the temporary element is greater than temporary value popped out from input stack. As long as this condition is valid, pop out element from temp stack and keep it pushing to input stack. So once we are out of the inner while loop. Finally, push the temp value to temp stack. So the iterations will continue until the input stack is empty. Once we are out of the while loop, the temporary stack will hold the sorted elements, the elements in sorted order. Now we will take this input stack, we'll apply these steps and we will see how we can sort elements using another temporary stack iteration one so as a first step we declared a temporary stack now let's assume that we are already inside while loop and since stack is input stack is not empty we will iterate until the stack is empty we are inside first iteration now pop out first element as given here from input element and assign to temporary variable now the temporary variable is holding value 14 as a second step we need to create a while loop and we need to take the top of top element of the temporary stack compare with temporary variable in the first iteration the temp stack is empty so it will never enter into the inner while loop so we'll come to this particular step and push 14 into temporary stack now we are going to iteration 2 in iteration 2 we'll pop out the element from input stack assigned to temporary variable now we'll compare this temporary variable with top of temporary stack so now is 14 greater than 72 no so what we do we will push temporary variable to temp stack and we'll go to iteration 3 in iteration 3 again we'll pop out an element from input stack assigned to temporary variable now again compare is top of this temporary stack is greater than the temporary variable yes in such case we will pop out the element from this stack and push to input stack now 72 will come here similarly again we will continue top of temporary variable is greater than the temp variable yes 14 is greater than 6 so we will pop out an element from here and push to input stack so now finally there are no elements left in temporary stack and we will push temporary variable to temp stack in iteration 4 again we will pop out an element assigned to temporary variable compare top of temporary stack with temporary variable which is less than 14 so finally we will push temporary variable to temporary stack and we will go to iteration 5 in iteration 5 again we will pop out an element from input stack 
then start comparing with temporary stack top values is 14 greater than 72 definitely not so we'll push temporary to sorry temporary value to temp stack now we'll move to iteration 6 in iteration 6 again pop out an element from input stack assign to temporary variable compare temp variable with top of temporary stack 72 is less than 80 so just to push 80 to temporary stack so now the input stack is empty we are done with our iterations if you look into the temporary stack the elements of the stack is already in ascending order so this is how we can implement sorting by using a temporary stack now let's write a code create a class stack sorting create a static method which returns stack as an output takes an input as a stop import stack so now inside this let's declare a temporary stack temp stack so now let's iterate through while loop the exit condition is we'll iterate through this while loop as long as given input stack is not empty input dot is empty and we'll iterate through as long as it is not empty so now as a first step pop out an element from input stack and assign to a temporary variable int temp equal to we assigned the pop dot element to temporary variable as a second step let's have a while loop inside this while loop iterate through this while loop until the temporary stack is not empty also we need to perform some operation we need to compare top element of the temp stack is greater than input i mean pop element the temporary variable or not in case if it satisfies we need to pop out element from temporary stack and push it to input stack so we'll add a condition here itself temp stack dot peak is greater than temp variable so now if this condition satisfies what we do will pop out from temporary stack temp stack dot pop and push it to input stack input dot push so once we are out of this while loop push the temporary variable to temporary stack so now once we are out of the outer while loop return temporary stack because that's the that is the stack which holds the sorted elements Now let's create a main method and test this code. Now first we'll print to print the input stack. And we make a call to the static 
method and we'll get the output and print that as well. Stack sorting dot sort stack and we'll pass input stack as an input. Now let's run the code and see the output. So we expect the output stack should be in sorted order. So here is the output. So the first line is representing input stack. The second line is representing output stack. The elements in output stack is in ascending order. Thanks for watching. Please like the video. Please subscribe to the channel.